So, how's it going on, guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. This is Greek, and welcome back to another episode of Silent Hill 2. This is episode number 7. I actually don't really remember where we left off. Actually, I do. This is the other world of the hospital, if I remember correctly. I'm not really sure. Oh, yeah, it is. These... Okay, so we need a button for that. Cool. There's a door here, though, that we can't really access. Now... Do I have a map? Oh. It's the same map? It's probably the same map. Alright. Let's go to the elevator. And let's go down to the basement. That's probably where we have to head. And let's just do that. Actually, we can't go to the basement. Therefore, we're gonna go to second floor. Now, we do not have Mar uh, Maria in this... Um, in this world, we're just alone. The last episode was actually pretty insane. What is this thing? Okay, we need a combination and then we need another. Okay, that's pretty insane actually. Oh shit. Dude, this looks really... I know exactly where we are, actually. We got some shotgun shells over here. Take that. Reload that. Uh, Alright. That's a nurse. Ooh, what the fuck? She has a knife. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Take that, James, please. Thank you. I know it, finally. Oh, how we danced, arms flailing, our bodies in perfect synchrony, and the music played, but in any dance, there's co there comes a time one must take the lead. And the music got louder and louder, pounding, piercing, and then silence. Uh, I don't understand that. I kind of know where we are. I'm not really sure, though. Look at that. Key of Bliss. Huh. We need to get ourselves to the freaking rest... We need to get to the lobby, I think. Potentially, because there's an exclamation point. Oh my god! What? Who the fuck? What the fuck are you? What the fuck are you? In instrument of force. Move. Yeah. We get the Lapis Eye Key. What the fuck is that, though? That's... That's actually a really clever puzzle if I've seen one. Okay, let's check the chain box. If I can maybe open this. Oh my god, it is! Okay. Oh my god, what is that? Never mind, we're not getting the director's uh, thing from the uh, from the box. We're getting it from... Oh. Oh! No one knows. Let me guess the number, 18. It's 2. So far, I actually, like, don't understand what's going on. In this other world, at least. At least the first one was pretty clear, but this one it really isn't. Alright, now we're going to this... Now we're going to the... Third floor? 17. Wait, where the fuck am I? Whoa! Wait, give me that ammunition, first of all. Before I do it... Before I do anything... Oh, syringe, nice. Nine. Oh! 
I found 0050 in the ECT room again. This time I checked. He was not appointed for the treatment. How is it possible he got there all by himself? And how would he know how to turn the thing on? Somebody's going to answer for this. So close, it will happen. Has to. Chain door. The, this is the elevator. I see. Give me that. They're generating. DVD! Oh, it's on now? Oh, there's a passage over here. I won't rest until they are solved. I won't rest. I can't rest. I don't know how to anymore. That's actually very insane. Oh, we're back here. Alright, let's see. Oh, that's so clever. Okay, anyways, 96.59. I think he marked it. Yeah. So now, I believe we just go down again. For which... Padlock is it? Well, it was... 96... It is, I'm not... Yeah, 969. This one? Oh, it is, okay. I didn't realize that, it, that he draw this. So... One year they've been watching me. What the fuck? Hold up. No. So, one year, they've been watching me. One, six, two... Maybe it's... Maybe the code is... Wait, hold up. It's standard one. Hold up. It's standard one, six, and two. But what is this code? Can I just run... It was two. It was twice. The, the light blinks twice. That's crazy. Wait, what? Nothing? We just did that for nothing? Okay, so I think I... Oh... Okay. Let's find the lady's ring. We'll see. She is an angel. No one knows only I can see the lady of the door. They cannot walk along her bridge of thread. They fall from the weight of their crimes. Like bloated and ugly corpses, their sins that devours them sin... And sinner alike, this she saves me. She's an angel. Insane. I don't. I. I don't know. Anyways, we gotta find her ring, and we're gonna go to the fucking basement for that. I hate. I hate this game. Some nurse. You're dead, dude. I knew it. There you go. You just stabbed me once, but you're gonna go down tonight. Now, where is the puzzle, dude? We'll get the ring. Maria! James! Mary! Or Mary, oh. sorry. Oh, it's Mar yeah, Maria. Maria, I thought. Sorry. Anyway, I'm glad you're alive. Anyway? What do you mean, anyway? I was almost killed back there. 
I have never been so scared in my whole life. All you care about is that dead wife of yours. You couldn't care less about me, could you? No, I just... Have and stay with me. Don't leave me alone again. You're supposed to take care of me. I... So what about Laura? You found her? Yeah, but she ran away. What? We have to find her. Yeah, you, uh... You really seem to care about that girl. Do you know her? I... I'd never met her before. I just feel sorry for her. She's all alone and... I don't know, for some reason I feel like it's up to me to protect her. Come on, let's go look for her. Now, hear me out, right? Maria said that I have to take care of her. Let's be brutally honest, bro. I didn't tell her to follow me in this whole adventure, bro. I didn't tell her to do that. She followed because she wanted, so... It's not really my fault, you know? Is that what I think it is? What? Wait, this? Having trouble there? Yeah. You think you could give me a hand? Me? You're supposed to be the big man around here. How's a little girl like me supposed to help? <laughs> Fine. Cute, is it? Here, why don't you take it? Thanks. Uh, I thought we needed one fucking ring. What the f Can I combine them? Hold up, because I've done the same. No. A ring made of lead, engraved with a terrified face. A ring made of copper, engraved with a spider. And here we what is that? Are. James? What's wrong? Let's just get out of here. There you go. What's wrong? I thought you wanted to get out of here. I know. It's just... Something doesn't feel right. Come on. It's gonna be fine. Let's see what... Oh, there's a note right here. It is done. Stick no more. Sick no more. I'm ready for the cutscene. I am so ready for the cutscene right now. 
Where? I can't even open the map. There's a cutscene coming, like, right now or something. Run! I fucking knew it. Run, bro, run. Okay, dude. Uh, this is... Oh, my days, no. That was scary as fuck. James? There! An elevator! Come on, hurry! No fucking way. Bro, what? Bro. No, 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 did no, 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 no. There is no way. No, that didn't happen. That didn't happen. That didn't happen. She's dead? What? Okay, we're out of- are we out of the uh... No, we're not. Oh, now we're at the lobby. Now we're in the lo- Ooh, now we're in the lobby of the- hot Of this place. The potential- Oh, fuck, man, I can't even read. The potential for this illness exists in all people, and under the right circumstances, any man or woman would be driven like him to the other side. The other side perhaps may not be the best way to phrase it. After all, there's no wall between here and there. It lies on the borders where reality and unreality intersect it is a place both close and distant some say it isn't even an illness i cannot agree with them i'm a doctor not a philosopher or even a psychiatrist unlike the director but sometimes i have to ask myself this question it's true that to us his imaginings are nothing but but the inventions of a busy mind but to him there simply is no other reality Furthermore, he is happy there. So why, I ask myself, why in the name of healing him must we drag him painfully into the world of our own reality? The hospital entrance key. And there's the little girl. And we're leaving! Uh... Okay. What are you doing? Just died, dude. Just died, dude. Uh. Right. I'm not even using the shotgun to be honest. I'm just gonna save it for a boss. How many bullets we got? We got a lot of bullets. 21. Breakable wall. Laura. Laura, stop! It's dangerous! Okay, maybe. Wait, if I shoot the legs... Wait, hold up. Wait, what? 
No way. Push her away, push her away. Oh, damn. And this is the... Oh. Late. Okay. Laura? Where did she go? To be honest, I, I don't know. He who is not bold enough to be stared at from across the abyss is not bold enough to stare into it himself. The truth can only be learned by marching forward. Follow the map. There's a letter and a wrench. Come here, dude. Oh, I know exactly where we freaking are. We can't go out that door because it's locked, but here. Now. Letter and wrench. Let's see. Hello? Anyone there? Or perhaps you are a fool truth usually betrays people you should know the key is in the park at the feet of the praying woman the wrench will open the gate the key will let loose the abyss okay oh the wrench that's oh the door that wakes in darkness opening into nightmares holy shit it's the thing from the beginning, it was there all along. Dude, it don't tell me we're in the we're at the end of the game. No, right? Wrench. Why you gotta Oh Dude no, why do we gotta go into the sewers? Whoa, whoa, run, run, run. I don't want to do that. We're back here now. I can't see anything at all. So there is something there inside, and then there's something else there. I think I get it. Who's that? Wait. Oh my god. It's Angela. Hey. Are you... Are you feeling better? This place is different from what I remember. I guess... Things never really stay the same, do they? Oh. I guess not. I don't... I don't... think she's here anymore, James. My mama? She's 
She doesn't... She doesn't want to see me anymore. Why would you think that? Anyway, I'm happy to see you. Happy to see me? Alive, I mean. Oh, yeah. I better get going. You still don't want me to go with you? If we stick together, we might just make it out of here. Out of where? This town. Silent Hill. No, it's fine. You didn't happen to see the little girl around here, did you? The little girl? Yeah, I... Angela? Are you all right? Angela? No. Please. I'm just gonna say one thing, and that's that the acting in this game, like every way the the acting, like voice acting and them just acting, it's perfect, bro. Oh, what is that? Okay, my patient buried it here. I knew, but did nothing. It made me uneasy to have such a thing near. I wasn't looking for the truth. I was looking for the tranquility. I also saw that thing. I fled, but, this, but the old society was sealed. No one dares to approach that place. Now, I offer you the key. If you still do not wish to stop, James, I pray to the Lord to have mercy on your eternal soul. Okay, so we got the historical society key. God damn. Wait, is it wait what is it missing a part? No. Okay. There it is. This is it, I see it. Uh okay. Here it freaking is. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, wow. Oh, oh look at that, misty day, remains of the judgment. The pyramid head, that's him, yeah. I really wonder whose uh, mansion this is. Uh, oh. Among the local legends is that of the Lady of the Light. The story tells of a woman who was accused and found guilty of witchcraft. As punishment, she was taken to a small island out of, on the lake. A minuscule stretch of rocky soil, devoid of any food or shelter. There, she was to suffer a slow, excruciating death, as her body succumbed to cold and hunger. However, unbeknownst to the rest of the townsfolk, there was a young man among them, who having gazed into the woman's eyes, as bright and beautiful as a midsummer's moon, had vowed undying love for her. When she was convicted, wrongly as he believed he swore, 
that he would not let her suffer such cruel fate while waiting for an opportunity to abscond with his beloved every night he would sneak out and row across the lake bringing her food and something to keep her warm and every night the woman would stand there on the shore holding a lit candle to help him find his way but then one night when the sky was ex exceptionally clear the void of even a wisp of cloud, the young man set out on his nightly es escapade. As always, he would look out into the distance, looking for the light in the darkness that would lead him to his beloved. On that night, however, the moon shone so bright and so vibrant, stronger than any candle could. Seeing the light's reflection in, in the water, the young man was led astray. He rode and rode and rode, following the reflected light, hoping against hope he could reach it. He did not care for his aching arms or the shortness of his breath. Utterly mesmerized by the illusory light, when his boat tipped over, the man was so exhausted from rowing, so weakened were his, were his arms, that he was not able to swim to shore. Thus, he succumbed to a watery grave. Although left alone, the woman on the island never lost hope. She kept coming out at night and kept lighting the candle. The legend says that those looking for true love can still see the lady's light out on the lake, shining to bring her beloved home. While the story is clearly meant as a metaphor and a cautionary tale, it is, to a certain extent, rooted in reality, as the area was, in was indeed seen its share of religious persecution such as that of 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 what okay it's that's the other page okay that's that was in then that was an insane lore that was insane lore oh no dude Oh, okay. Hello. I hope that's not a puzzle. Oh no, dude. It's the fucking hole from the picture. And we have to jump down. Well, jump. I, don't, I can't do anything else. Yeah, jump. Really, jump. I'm not pressing a third time, bro. Let's jump. I'm not even in the sewers anymore. Is that Angela? Is that Angela? Where the fuck am I now? Give me that. Wait, wait, that's Mary. No? Isn't that her shirt? No, that's someone dead. Big deal. Just put the gun to their head and. Hey, yo, what the fuck? Eddie? Oh, uh. Hi, James. What happened here? Who was that? I don't know. It just came at me. Okay. So he attacked you, and you shot him. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. He made me do it. Okay, calm down, Eddie. Any idea why he would do that? I don't know. He came out of nowhere. He tried sneaking up on me in the dark. I heard footsteps, so I turned back, and he was right there. And you could tell that he wanted to hurt you. Well, yeah, I mean... The way he looked at me, I just had to do it. He looked at you? I thought you said he came at you. Yeah, I mean, hey, I could see it in his eyes. His eyes? He 
kept looking at me, making fun of me. And I told him not to, but uh, he didn't listen. Eddie, you can't... You can't just kill someone because the way they looked at you. <laughs> you should see your face, James. I was just joking. The guy was dead when I got here. I got you, didn't I? <laughs> well, anyway, I better get going. Wait. You're gonna go out there alone? Yeah. I have no, no, no. I'm just gonna say this, right? That is not J. Uh, not James. Sorry, uh, that is not Eddie. Okay, that is not the Eddie that uh, that we know from the beginning, from part two. This is not Eddie, bro. Hello, hello. This is Greek guys. This is Editor Greek. Actually, sorry for interrupting the video. The next area of the game is supposed to be a prison, but I'm not gonna show that because uh, OBS decided that it's gonna corrupt my recordings and um, I don't have access to that recording anymore. I'm done with that section. Uh, I'm gonna show you footage from after the prison. So everything is fine with the recordings, but the prison just got corrupted. So basically we have to get ourselves uh, small weights and we had to tilt the scales of justice, like in the Atlas Trials, but not really the same we had to tilt the scales of justice to get in certain doors to get through to the next area so yeah therefore there is no prison area anyways i'm so sorry for the inconvenience uh let's go to the next area though which is actually pretty spicy in my opinion oh Saving. Oh shit. The Bo Blank F, a man later identified as Thomas Oro Blank Lumberjack, age 39, was discovered in the line. The probable cause of as multiple stab wounds to the front of the neck and the left side of the torso by a sharp edged weapon, the estimated of death was somewhere between 11 and 12.30 midnight. To do signs of struggle in the room and the lack of a murder weapon, police are considering this a homicide and have opened a murder investigation. Furthermore, given the fact that the cash in the room was untouched and Mr. a history of drunkenness and violence, the police will protect that was not robbery, crime. Okay, interesting. Let's keep going. Daddy, it's Angela. No. Oh shit. That's wrong. And this is right, right? Here we go. Please. I'll be good, I promise. Tell him I'll be good, please. Angela? Angela, it's me. No, please. Daddy!
Holy shit. What the fuck? Can I go back in here? Here we go. This way? Try. Try what? Like you don't know? I see what you're doing. It's always the same with you. You're only after one thing. Angela, please. You don't have to lie. Go ahead. Say it. could just force me <laughs> like he always did <laughs> anymore no you probably found someone else no I need to find my mama happened like right now i i certainly have like attachment issues with games because angela said actually angela she said admit it you didn't want her around she knew something you know what would have been crazy if my boy james here if he actually if he, nah, I'm gonna say this, but it's probably the worst thing you're gonna hear all day. But what if James murdered Mary, but somehow just doesn't remember it? No, no I, I don't know. That's just that's just some that's just some weird speculation. That's not no no. Okay, you know. Oh shit! Oh, we got a map, the labyrinth center. Okay. It's a- oh, we're in a labyrinth. Oh. What the actual fuck is that? Oh, I thought we had to jump down. Okay, never mind. It's just stairs. Oh 
Oh my god, it's fucking Maria? What the fuck? Maria? Maria! I thought that thing killed you. Are you hurt? Not at all, silly. But the thing. It stabbed you. There was blood everywhere. Stabbed me? What do you mean? It chased us to the elevator and then. James. What are you talking about? Just before. Don't you remember? James? Honey? Did something happen to you? After we got separated in that long hallway? Are you confusing me with someone else? <laughs> you were always so forgetful. Remember that time in the hotel? Maria? Wait, what you is said she? you took everything. But you forgot that videotape we made. Huh? I wonder if it's still there. What is she talking about? How do you know about that? Aren't you Maria? I'm not your Mary. So you are Maria. I am. If you want me to be. All I want from you is an answer. It doesn't matter who I am. I am here for you, James. See? I'm real. Don't you want to touch me? If you happen to make up your mind. I'll be waiting. I, uh... I'll find some way to... I'll come back, I promise. <laughs> 